Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Enshrouded. I am Zystars, and first thing I'd like to do is thank all you wonderful individuals who came out for the streams or watched the videos afterwards. There were a lot of them. There's many hours of content, so by all means, go check it out. Beyond that, today's goal is going to be this, which is probably a shroud route, followed by the Sun Temple. I'm probably going to die a lot. Uh, because the Sun Temple is dangerous, but whatever. Hurt! Hurt! Yeah! Oh, I bet you that's the Sun Temple right there. Now, the question is, where is this route? Because goals and reasons and things and what the hell? There we go. Okay, we're still good on stamina. We're going to need to turn slightly to the left. We are less good on stamina. Uh, we're getting there. Oh, I that. Oh, that's the elixir well. All right, we're going to have to drop. That was not how you drop. That's how you drop. Uh, we are really, really low on stamina. Let's land. Come on, baby. Land for me. Uh, yeah! If you missed all of the streams, we have made a lot of progress. If you just didn't have time to watch all that content. We've made a lot of progress. We've got a lot of good new weapons. And uh, we did a lot of stuff on the upper section of the map. Up here. It was a good time. Now, we need to get over to here. Let's see, these guys are usually, well, fire or ice, it's kind of a toss-up. Those things are, I think, ice susceptible. But if I don't have to fight him, I'm not going to. Okay. And we got some skill points put in shroud, shroud resistance, so I've got lots of shroud resistance on there. We did a lot of upgrades to the base, which was pretty sweet. Uh, we added in a bunch of comfort stuff. Uh, reconfigured the basement to throw the alchemist down there. And we are, we've started making all of the stuff in order to get the warlock set. But, man, you need a lot of padding and stuff for that. A lot of padding. I've got the flax crafting right now that I need for the padding. It's just, it's taken a long time and a lot of flax. And I made a mistake and accidentally uprooted. I thought it was done. The crop was done and I was uprooting friggin seedlings instead of uprooting actual flax so I've got half of well maybe a little less than half of my crop uh oh that guy's that uh, I had to redo that's a high level thunder brute I don't know my weapons are they're not they're not as OP as they used to be against these against the guys because these guys are all level 30 but we will do what we can. Here we are. Uh, that looks cool, but I'm being attacked, so we'll look at it later. There we are. Alright, quick cheeky look. This is the Radiant Paladin's chest piece. Holy crap! That's awesome. I heard that that chest piece is damn legit. So, we're gonna definitely be happy about that. Here, give me this. Alright. There's somebody over there, but I'm not worried about him. I want up there. Get the shroud root. Oh, dear. Fool thinks he's fighting a melee character. But he is wrong! Here we go. Aha, sucker! And if you didn't know, you can hold the shield button and attack with it, you know, still held out, which is friggin' sweet. Oh, what do we got here? On the reward, this mysterious wonder promised me ever quickly. This is the way the, the, the specter, the ghost who distorts reality. I hid corrupted staff atop a wooden structure overlooking the elixir distillery. Only I deserve it. All right, we'll take a look at that in a minute, too. Oh, fabric. I will take. Padding is expensive, I'm finding out. Like, really expensive. That didn't help. It takes a lot of fabric to make padding. 
Let's see. This isn't going to work. Uh, let's do it like this. Go up. We'll jump. Oh, it didn't work. Alright, let's try again. Kind of curious what that thing is over there. It keeps popping up with its hit points. Alright, we're going to jump a little sooner. And space bar. Yeah! Ah, suck it. Any bugs? I hate the bugs. Yeah! Skill points! What? What? Alright, anyway. <laughs> that was stupid. Okay, here's our skill point loadout. We got the, the desert stomach. As well as all the stuff that leads up to it. We grabbed updraft. We grabbed blink unity for wand stuff. Repeated wand damage. Spawning additional wand projectiles. Spirit intelligence down here. We grabbed all of this stuff out this way. Uh, oh, I'm about to grab boosted lightning damage. Radiant aura, sun, spirit. So we got all of that good stuff. I got a few points left. Not sure what I want to put them on. Okay. So now we need to go towards the sun temple. The question is, can we get there? Probably right over here. If I didn't have to go back, I wasn't going to. Hello, sun temple. Uh, someone said they put... They put a temple somewhere in the sun temple to make it easy to go in and loot stuff. Uh, and then someone said go into it on the east side. So, yeah, I think we'll go in down here. All right. Oh, and then... And then something about boomies. Using explosives to get in. But honestly, I have no idea. I've just got this, and we're just kind of YOLO in this shit. Look at this. 240 health and 24 stamina. What am I wearing right now? 90 health and 72 mana. 41 and 82. Okay. I mean, that's... Alright. Well, let's take a look around. Uh, that's some pretty sweet armor. I've heard the paladin set is super legit. I bet I could get into there. Uh, if I would have not done it quite like that. Here, let's teleport up. Get a little bit more height. Whoops. Alright, let's... Jump! Alright. Oh, shit! What did I just... Oh, damn it to bollocks! Whoops, that is not what I meant to do. <laughs> Alright, let's get that off my screen. Okay, so we are going to jump and fly, double tap, and land here, okay? And then... We're going to hit this guy with... I don't think I can hit him with anything from here. Okay, so there's there's an entrance down there and an entrance up here. Not an entrance, but an area up here. Okay, we could go in there. We got some pots. I don't know, I guess there's a dude there. We go in. Uh, not in there. There's a switch. Let's go ahead and hit that. Just in case I need it. Right, there's a temple. There's a guy. Can't hit him. There's a bat thing. Here, let's come over here. Okay, there's a dude. There's a sarcophagus right there that I... I think this is the room everybody was talking about. Okay. And then there's this dude. There we go. Alright, do these guys have anything? Eh, bone, salt. Bone salt scraps, bone salt, bone salt. All right. Uh, this is a great mace. Wonderful. Yay, a great mace. All right. What else goes on in here? 
Let's get the marker off the map. Among the Blue Jays. So somewhere in here is a super wow glider. Can't get into any of these. I found. There's a button right here. Not sure what it does, but... Oh, look! Oh, okay. Maybe there's something in there that I need? See, there's traps behind all of this stuff. Which is kind of a fascinating thing to do. Alright, we're gonna go a different route. From what I understand... Oh, we have, to, we have to get up to the top of the, uh, the thing there. Up to the top of that there. What are they doing down there? Making some babies. We get on the top of that, and the ghost glider is as good as ours. That's what it's called, the ghost glider. Which, uh, the, the uh, updraft skill is friggin' fantastic for getting up to these things. Because it allowed me to get a little higher up, which I wasn't able to do when just normal. The other thing you can do, I guess, is utilize the pick and just kind of pick your way. But that seems yo, horrible. Like, could you imagine trying to carve your way through one of these caverns? That would be absolutely terrible, and there's no way in hell I'm doing it. I saw... Bird, bat, eagle, not eagle, dragon, not dragon wings over here. Okay, I kind of want up there. Come on. There we go. See? No pickaxe required. Uh, this, I should be able to get up there now. Oh, look, there's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, yeah, the guy, a thing. Can I fireball him from here? Well, that hit him. Really? Almost got him. Sweet. Die, bitch. Alright, now we don't have to worry about that. But look, there's a chest up there. Up in the up, up, up. Jump! And fly. And drop. Oh, crap! Oh, crap, oh, crap. Oh, Jesus. Okay, there's one there. I want that chest, too. Let's see if I can get that one without dying. Sweet, silver chest. Uh, eagle eye helmet. All right. And... Hurt. All right. And where's the chest? Here we go. Boom. Ghost glider. Boom goes the dynamite. Okay, so it's 50% better with the range. The speed is faster. Same stamina per second. So it's going to drain stamina at the same speed, but it's going to let me go a little faster. Now, the other thing with the Sun Temple is that legendary chest. So far, I've gotten Arrow Striker and a Great Mace out of it, which, admittedly, really good weapons. But they're not, like, super amazing WoW cool. Radiant Paladin chest piece is also... Only mod or, or like okay. I mean, it's cool. But I'm gonna go through and we're gonna farm the shit out of that just a little bit more and kind of see what all is down there. Kind of want to see what's down here too. So yeah, you can absolutely cheese this place and not open any of these doors. There's another chest. Wolf's Claw? Okay. The names for these. 47. Alright. Yeah, they, they said... Maybe it patched it out. But said that was a legendary chest you can keep farming. So, let's see what I get. Alright, so that was the most boring shit I've ever done. So, we got... This stuff is pretty sweet. 
and not that. We got this thing, Elder Chest, Eagle Eye, Radiant Paladin, an Elder Hat, which is pretty pretty cool. We got Radiant Paladin Gloves, which I guess is cool. And we got an Eagle Eye Hat. So we got a couple pieces of these. We got this sword, which is okay, I guess. Uh, that's the staff that we had already. Game refuses to give me a new staff that's, in, that's better. But this is level 24, so I guess it's pretty good. But you get a couple of these wands, so we got two of them. Take our fire wand. I feel like this one's probably going to be better. Where is my... Let's go talk to this lady here. Hey, lady. Will you upgrade my stuff for me? Let's see. Crackling wand. Stay safe. All right. Crackling wand, 47 damage. Infernal wand, 47 damage. Crackling wand has a little bit lower overcharge. I don't know what overcharge is. Okay, Infernal Wand's got better durability. So yeah, I guess we'll keep we'll whoops, we'll keep the, that one. This one's not as good. Uh this Wet Wolf Sword looks pretty sweet, but it's all shroud damage, so you would have to not use it in the shroud. Uh Guillotine Axe, we've seen that, though this one is level 25, so I think it's better. Arrow Striker, again, cool. Blunt damage weapon, great maze, cool, bronze sword. I mean all it Eh! None of that shit's worth my worth the time, I don't think. Now, there are a couple of other spots people like to go to to farm things. Um, I want to say they're like over this area somewhere down here. Yeah, they like fly this, this way and get them. But I have no friggin' desire to farm legendary gear like that right now. So we're not going to do it. We're just going to go do some other cool fun th things. So I've kind of organized this stuff. This is a pretty sweet sword. It's pretty cool looking. But we're just going to throw all of this extra stuff. Oh, let's look at the guillotine. So here's a level 16 guillotine. And a level... Yeah, so... We'll shit can that. We got this sun hammer. Pretty cool looking. Deep root axe. Like, this is really low level. So we're just going to S can that. The arrow striker is pretty sweet. Great mace, I guess. Is okay. Wolf's claw. I mean, if you're going to use a melee axe... Guess the wolf's claw is the one to go with. Here, let's get rid of that. It's pretty low damage. Uh, the infernal wand, we'll, we'll keep one of those just for posterity. Wolf snarl bow, 34 damage. I mean, that's pretty good. Or 35, sorry. These are both level 10. We got the bronze sword, level 10. Another, another one handed weapon that's pretty sweet. Level 10. Level 25. What else do we get? Uh, we got an iron arrow. And then a bunch of, a bunch of these. Now, as far as this stuff goes, the Elder Chest piece is pretty much the exact same as my Magician's Chest piece, just better. Now, the Elder Hat is the same deal. It's the exact same, it's just better. And then these other ones are not, so... And then I also organized all of this shit. So, these are my sets of things. Some of this stuff is pretty dumb. I'm not sure why I'm keeping it. Like, the Warrior's Trousers and Warrior's Helmet. I don't know. Probably get rid of it. But for now, we're just going to put this stuff down here. Kind of hold on to it. Eagle Eye chest piece. I mean, it's legendary stuff. What did I just do? Warrior, okay. Why can't I delete it? I can delete that. Alright, let's just get rid of that. Get rid of those. We'll put the Eagle Eye here. Eagle Eye hat. Radiant Paladin. Okay, let's get rid of this wizard stuff. Since we only have two pieces, they don't really matter. Those Radiant Paladin. And then we're wearing the other one, so we'll just keep that stuff down there. So, I mean, it's cool. It, it's pretty sweet. Like, there's things and stuff over here, but, you know, it's like, eh. Am I going to go through and just constantly farm? Probably not. But since we're here and I got that, let's go back over. And let's see. I'm kind of curious what Myth of Giants is, and I also want to do that. So we're going to zip back over, and we're going to go we're gonna go grab that, and then go check out Myth of Giants. There's a couple other places that look kind of neat. Um, and there are a couple of other legendary chests out there that I wouldn't mind hitting once or twice, but I seriously doubt I'm going to have the patience to go hit them over and over and over again. All right, uh, let's get some food in us. Alright. And everything's copacetic. 
This one's only a couple hundred meters, so it should be pretty easy to get there. Oh, look at this thing go. There's a structure up there. I wonder what that is. Let's see. I bet you that's it right there. There it is, right there. There's a dragon thing. Oh, drop down, stupid. Ow! Man, I suck at that. Okay, so this is... Oh! This is not good, is what that is. Hey, dude. We got some guys. Some guys that object to me being here. Luckily, those raids don't do well against AoEs. Alright, so we're good there. Alright, back to the tower. Nope, not back to the tower. I killed that thing. Oh, I'm just out of it. There we go. Back to the tower. That was pretty sweet. Yeah. I mean, it... It would be cool to have all those legendary items, for sure. Okay, Myth of Giants, let's go to the journal, but what's the point in the game right now? Uh, Myth of Giants doesn't seem... Among the blue... I've got the legendary glider. I must not have done it in the right order, though. I just kind of went there and grabbed it. And then we got to do this Hearts of Iron one, but we're not doing that right now. We're going right here, because I want to see what that is. Now there's this thing you can do, you go like that, then you go boom, boom, and then you can do the updraft again. Some guys are really fast at it. I'm not that fast at it yet. Let's see, what are we looking for? We got the red stuff down there. I'm not even sure what this Myth of Giants thing is. Okay. Ooh, what do we got here? Oh, that's sulfur. Okay, that just looked weird. Right, let's see. Let's go out a little bit and we'll walk back in. Alright. Myth of Giants. Okay. Let's see, there's a scroll. Who's from a shaman? Oh, okay, so it's got a different spot. Alright, it looks like that said back to East Lapis. I wonder if that's part of a quest that I already completed. That'd be funny. Alright, um, let's see, that's done. Lapis was over here somewhere, wasn't it? Yeah. No, there's nothing there. So I must have done it already since it didn't add a new marker. So, let's see. Heart of Iron? We can go check that out. I haven't been there yet. That's the uh, the iron mine that the, the blacksmith told us about. Okay. So it says it's 100 meters away and I'm passing it. So is this iron mine in the shroud? Yeah. Who decided that was a good idea? Alright, we're going to have to get a little bit lower. Hard to see in the shroud. Ooh, that almost didn't work. Okay, that... What? Why does it say 4,000 meters now? Okay, well, let's deal with this. Okay, so did I... Is there a spawner over here I'm missing? I don't see one. There's that guy up there. Okay, so did I miss something? Oh, here we go. Oh, it must have keyed off on a different quest. 
from the Blue Jays. Yeah, probably it probably keyed off on that quest. Okay, so the mine is behind me. Let's go take a look. Sword. Oh, here's some iron. All right. So is this the iron mine I was talking about? I guess. I mean, you just come here and you can mine. You can mine a bunch of iron until your pick breaks right there. Oh my God. These bugs. It says it's right over here. Why would they put an iron mine they expect you to go into in a friggin' the shroud? There we go. And you gotta deal with these exploding bugs now. Nah, there's way better places. Way better places to get iron. Okay. What the hell was I thinking with this setup? There we go. All right, let's take a look around. I don't see a mine per se. All I see are bugs everywhere. There we go. And I mean everywhere. Oh, there we go. Destroy that shit. Get out of here, spawner. It says I'm like right on top of this mine, but this this isn't a mine. This is just a bunch of no a bunch of iron nodes. There's a golden chest. I'll take that. Gloom Monarch Trousers. Okay. Yeah, all in all, I'm a... I'm a little disappointed in this spot. This is... super dumb. And this is not... This is just dumb. I... Okay, I have to be missing something. Let me look around a little more. Something hiding in the ground here. Oh, is it just a shroud canceller? I broke it. Yeah, I think that was just a shroud canceller. Alright, so there's a warlock temple that way. Or not warlock temple. <laughs> warlock armor. There's a sun temple that way. I think we're going to go to it. We're going to have to use that weird drop and climb. You know, you, you cancel the glide and then jump the, do the glide again to get there. But we're going to go. We got lots of stamina. We should be able to make it. We've got the good glider. We're gonna go up. Ooh, that ate a little bit of stamina, didn't it? But I think, oops, yeah, that way. I want to say we're gonna try to probably get to that cliff right there. So drop and glide. The guy, I, the video I watched, the guy did it way faster. I don't know if I'm doing it in such a way that it's gonna be better. Maybe we'll glide to that right there. That might be a little bit better. Yeah, so he hit it pretty quick, and I'm not hitting it as fast as that guy did, but that's alright. We're going this way. Um, we're kind of getting there. It's probably that up there. I don't know what's supposed to be at it, but it's a sun temple. Okay. Whew, for a second there, I thought we were done. Dunzo. Dunzo, Washington. Alright, so this spot here is another legendary chest that I found. Not I didn't find it. I got I found a guy a guy found it and I've stolen his information. Why is it being weird? There we go. So we're gonna throw just a little block here. Just like he suggested, and then we're going to put a clip on here. So now when we spawn in. We can just zip over. Let's see, did I do it? Like, it spawns me right here. 
So I do have to move a little bit, but that's all right. And then... Okay, Eagle Eye Boots. Yep, these are level 25. So this is way easier if you want to spawn... Whoops, did I take it? If you want to if you want to do a uh, a farming event, you know, you just kind of want to come over here. So if this is level 25 here, just like just like in that sun temple down here. Just like in this sun temple, which yeah, that it's it's the same thing. Ridgeback Mountain. Yeah. Pretty sweet, I guess. So I'll keep that in mind. Maybe I'll if I get bored one day or whatever, then I'll come through and start doing that. I did bring a box. A large box to put stuff in. I can kind of store store some stuff here. That way I can... If I, if I decide to farm it, I could just do it. But I'm not going to do that right now. Right now, I think we're going to head over to this Sun Temple, which is right there. And we got the greatest game and that over there. But since I didn't actually go through the Sun Temple like I was quote-unquote supposed to... I figured we might as well do it. Okay, so it's right over here. Let's flip. Uh, that's uh, the shroud. We're not going that way. All right, this looks like Sun Temple. Not sure what's in here. The other, the one Sun Temple had a big boss that gave some sweet stuff, but and then it might just be that this is a there's like a legendary chest at the bottom of it. But you know, whatever. We'll see. Oh, did I? I still have these blocks on me. Get rid of that. I got these eagle eye boots, but I'm not I'm not working on eagle eye boots right now. Let's see, wait is is this it? Oh, this isn't the Sun Temple. This is just a, oh this is just a neat little walkway. Huh? Okay. All right. Let's see what's in here. There's a door. Stuff. Ooh, a lockpick. I'm still making flax for that other set of armor, the warlock set. What? Is this the temple? Alright. Screw you guys. I saw another one in here. These guys hit really hard. Alright. Now, if we look around, I see... That was sweet, I guess. I have no idea what the point of that was supposed to be. I can see out the window, but all right, maybe to get away from the enemy. Uh, okay, <laughs> spikes. What the hell are those spikes there for? There's some stairs, spikes on it, and nothing up there. There's a door. That's the door with the four light thingies. All right, got meteor. That's interesting. Can I shoot that? Oh. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay, I'm not sure what that was supposed to be for. Looks like there's another one over here. Okay, and then another one up here. Um. That was sweet. All right. That's a button. Okay. That's a button for something. I'm not sure what. Maybe for the main building. Maybe you got to go to these outbuildings. Is it dark? Is it nighttime? Oh, crap. Uh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't bring an altar. Not that I can put another one up. I'd have to go back to that one. If I were to go through the night. So we're just gonna... We're just gonna hang in the darkness, I guess. Oh yeah, that opens. Okay. So this main Sun Temple door... Needs the... Needs me to open these things. That's not going to take forever in the darkness. All right, you know what? You know what I think I'm going to do, ladies and gentlemen? I think I'm going to cut this one. We'll come back to the Sun Temple another day. I am going to head back home. I'm going to complete that other that Warlock set, because why the hell not? And then uh, we'll come back to this one on the next episode. 
because I think we've done a lot. My timer's showing me we've got over half an hour worth of worth of good information. So yeah, let's just press press the pause button for now. So ladies and gentlemen, I do hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, please do me a favor, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel for a little bit more content, leave a comment in the comment section, and share the video with your buddies because YouTube says sharing is caring. And as always, everyone, I do hope that you have a great rest of your day.